Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to my another new video. I am Quenso. I make studio light tutorial videos. So today I am gonna show you how to add Sila Brain Dot model in Roblox Studio Light. So in this video I will tell you how to cut and delete a folder and keep it into another file. So many people has doubts about that. So to in this video I will explain that. Before we proceed, please make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. We are very close to 2,000 subscribers, and at November 12th, my channel's anniversary is there. So uh, be aware of that. And thanks for supporting me. So let's proceed. First, click on Toolbox and click here and enter this asset ID. If you enter the asset ID, now click on Get. You can pause the video. And you can copy it, or you can simply go to the description and you can copy it. First, click on Get, and wait for a few seconds. It will just take up to five, two or six seconds. Yeah. Yeah. So here's the thing. Now I will tell you how to keep the things in different places. First, open the Steela Brain dot folder. Open the Steela Brain dot folder and search for ungroup in lighting. And open it and click on blur and first cut and delete it. Here one option is there at up cut and delete and keep into lightning. You can see it and click on paste info. At up paste info is there, so you can click on that. Simply using this method, you can do. But if there are too many folders, you can just click on one folder. I mean one part or file, and click on select multi, and you can select so many things at once. If you have so many, and click on cut delete and paste it into workspace. Yeah. Now what's replicated storage? Now click on this and cut and delete it and paste it into replicated storage. Now server script service. So click on these scripts and cut and delete it and paste it into server script service. And now for next one is server storage. So cut and these all the things and keep on server stories yeah here and now come over start as ui now select these all and you can simply cut and delete these and keep on start as ui now uh, the second last one is start a player scripts now cut and delete these all and you have to go to starter player and open starter player scripts and in starter player scripts you can paste info so it will come there now which is the last one the sound script yeah sound service so sound service is not supported in studio light so we will just cut and delete this now these are waste these is ungrouped in starter player scripts. These are all waste. Those are ungrouped. So you can simply cut and delete it. Even the license and information. Cut and delete it. And the stealer thing folder is also not required. But don't cut and delete these all. Because you already imported them to the workspace. Now your game is ready. If you want the configurations, you can do. I already explained in my another video you can watch I just give the link in description box go and watch that video so first let me show you by testing it so I'm just saving it and I'm publishing into my game it will just take a few seconds to sub uh, publish it you can also learn how to publish and make API key by this video. I give that video also in the description box. So it will just take you a few minutes. Now 
Now we'll test it out. So yeah, it's out. Game a game. This is the testing game that I use to test those. These are working, you can see. Not enough room, yeah. There's no room left over here. So first let me sell these. Yeah, this is working. And these are all working. Even this night one. Can I run this purchase? You can purchase it through Robux. It's working. But you need to spend some Robux on here. It's a it's 45 robux i think so yeah 45 robux so this is working thanks for watching my video thank you so much